This program contains strong language and sexual references throughout. While Corey's still not back from his date with Anya, Sophie's busy thinking about their kiss last night. It was stupid of me to kiss him last night, but it did just feel, yeah, you know no, when you're drunk. it was a game. It was a game and you had a drink, but... I did it one more time, though. So, give me a hand. You're bad mind. Give me a hand. Two, three more. I love Sophie to bits, but I think she's leading Corey down the garden path a little bit. Oh. Oh. Hello. 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 How was it? We went for a walk through like a little seasidey, like towny thing. Yes. <gasps> oh. So let's get down to the nitty gritty then. Is there a connection or a spark there, do you think? Would you like to go on another date? Yeah, well, like we had a good day. It was nice. Um, I feel like his head's elsewhere. Got other situations going on, so yeah. I don't feel like I should get in the middle of it. If situation is me, <laughs> you're not getting in the middle. <laughs> oh, I'm not a situation. Sophie, I'm a person. Sophie, I Sophie. don't know. There's more to Sophie. it. Sophie, calm yourself down, Sophie. Look, she's he's not just... saying it because of what you've said. She's yeah, but that's like of your opinion, whereas oh. I think he feels differently. Like, not funny. Everyone can see how you two are together. So for you to say stuff like that, you shouldn't be saying stuff because it's a little bit disrespectful. Do you know what I'm saying? He clearly likes you. If he's going to pursue anyone, it's going to pursue you. Look, I don't know where she's at. I don't think anyone does. I don't even think she knows where she's at. But worst of all, she's playing with Corey's head. It's like you say, when, like, you're not even interested in me at all, yeah. but then you were you like, kissing me last night. Do you know what I mean? It's... It's not like you can't say you're not interested in me and we're just friends, like, do you know what I mean? And then you just play it down a little bit too much. I do care about you and your feelings, but you haven't told me. So you know you know how I feel. You, you know that I like you. I've told you that as well. I feel like she's just fucking been playing a game the whole time. It's not just me who's noticed it. Obviously, Lockie's telling me the same thing, so it's obviously, it's obviously happening. Don't think I don't love you, and I'm not. I'm digging no, you out. No, it's okay. It's just you didn't. You didn't need to say that in front of her because it's a sort of like a bit of kicking the bollocks for him. The last thing I would want to do is hurt his feelings. Like I care about him probably the most you in this video. And he cares for you. No, but I, it's not Listen, about that, is it? Hey, you don't get upset. Listen, I didn't want to upset you. It's not about you, it's it's about the fact that it's like the one I actually care about here. Yeah. If I hurt him. Even if you say you don't want to progress anymore, he's a big boy. But what I'm saying is, you've got to learn there's a time and a place, and that was what wasn't a time and a place to have that convo. That's what it was. The reason I reacted because it came as a bomb on me, I didn't know, he hasn't told me. 